know what uh, turns me on uh, about Suzanne? One of the things is, is, uh, you know, it's sort of weird saying this, but I, I don't like saying it because I'm supposed to be a, a, a strong man. And that's, I love when she makes me feel like a very special somebody, like a special somebody, um, like a dignitary, like uh, uh, an authority, um, like a king, like a sovereign, like a knight, like someone of value, not just to myself, unto myself, but someone of value to the bigger picture. And I can't tell you exactly how she does it, but she just, she's got that look when she looks at me that can uplift me and she knows how to like, you know, crush it too. I don't think she means to crush it. I think when, when it gets crushed in me, it's probably, I, I, I deserve it somehow, but I don't want to admit it right now. All right, so if you, don't look at this if you're Suzanne, turn away. All right, this is just between me and you. All right, don't let her know that I said this. But the other thing is, is on some level, I feel, you know, as a guy, I've heard I'm not supposed to have to care if my wife gives me praise or not. In fact, that if I want her to give me some type of praise, it makes her sick. And it, and it causes a, her to lose that libido, that polarity, that, that sizzle with me. If I'm wanting her to uh, always give me some type of acknowledgement and praise, it could be a turnoff. I know that. And although I know that, there's still a part of me that wants that, you know? But I can't really uh, let my needy part beg her for that acknowledgement or make her wrong for it by holding back my love, my connection, my, my, my claim of her, my strength, my presence, you know? So it's, it's this funny paradox that I'm sure you and I go through in some way, you know? I'm just putting things in words a lot of us guys have going on, running. And what I, what I really want to wanna say is, is that it's like the moment she looks at me with the sense of like I'm a dignitary, and I'm an authority. I've got a uniform on in some way. And um, then she looks at my inside. She looks at my heart. She knows how to look at the soft parts of me, not just my um, strong parts. And she knows how to touch me with the way she, her tone of voice, her look in her eyes, the way she moves. And... Um, she sees me for who I am, for real. And it's from that real place that she'll play this little sizzle game. She'll start off with really connected without creating a sizzle, without creating polarity. And then she starts turning that polarity on stronger and stronger, meaning she becomes more sensual with me. While staying connected and, and sh in a way, in a non too fuzzy way, in a fake way, not in a fake way, not in a bimbo-ish way, but in a very real way, honoring um, my masculinity, my uh, masculine uh, uh, vibe, energy, you know, my presence. So, uh, what do you think, guys? Do you think, uh, you know, is, am I on the right track? Is this, is this so for you? You know, um, I'd love you to comment and share what's, what's so for you. What's something that your woman does that's deep? You know, not just uh, putting on some sexy lingerie and all that. We can discuss that. We can have a lot of fun with that. There's nothing wrong with that. That's hot too, really. But I also want to, you know, what does she do that's deep, that sort of touches you a little more, scratches beyond the surface of just your uh, desire for sex or, or ramping up the sex urge? What gets your sex urge going and at the same time knocks on a, on a deeper door, calls you to become a little bit more present? more full, more vulnerable, and hold your um, masculine strength, your spine. Love to know about it, love to share about it, and challenge other men to wake up with it. So let's uh, get on this and make some comments and pass it around and share this uh, with other uh, guys who are passion igniters.